My name is Doug Mayo. I'm the County Extension Director in Jackson County, Florida. My name is Ethan Carter and I'm the Regional Crop IPM Agent based in Jackson County. I support agents from Jefferson to Escambia County in the Panhandle and through this video we're going to briefly share with you how UF IFAS Extension can help producers and ranchers better manage their operations. In 1914, the Smith-Lieber Act established the Cooperative Extension Service across the U.S. In Florida, the public land-grant institutions are the University of Florida and Florida A&M. For more than a century, county extension agents have been taking the science-based knowledge from these public universities to farmers in partnership with USDA and your local Board of County Commissioners. Modern Agricultural Extension utilizes a wide range of communication and training tools to help farmers and ranchers make informed choices to deal with challenging issues. The first of these is individual grower consultations. The Extension Service provides advice and recommendations on a wide range of topics. Every farm management system is unique, so our agents are trained to investigate problems, offer solutions or options for management, and connection with local resource people that provide goods and services for the agricultural industry. Whether you've recently inherited a farm and are trying to figure out how to manage it, or you're a seasoned farmer with years of experience, there are always issues and challenges that require assistance. I'm not saying that our agents know all the answers, but we are connected to hundreds of scientists and industry professionals with wide-ranging expertise. We are your local resource people that can help you connect with the best knowledge available on a given subject related to agriculture. A second tool available through the University of Florida are diagnostic services. The university provides a wide range of diagnostic services to help identify pests and problems and offer management recommendations. The diagnostic labs provide soil testing for fertility and nematodes and identification for weed, insect, and diseases. We also offer tested control options for many pest issues. If you see something unusual or have plants that are not doing quite right, just give us a call and we can utilize these services to better understand the problem. Of course, there are always new issues and challenges that arise, so there will be times when there is not a simple economical solution. These are the types of challenges that require research to develop practical solutions. This, too, is a way county agents connect local people with the university system to work on major issues of concern. A third tool we utilize for farmers and ranchers are organized educational trainings. Uh, farmers and ranchers and their employees can get training uh, that are offered throughout the year by the Extension Service. Growers don't have time to take college classes, so county agents organize training events at convenient times throughout the year. There are a variety of options that range from multiple day conferences, single day meetings, field days on research stations, or farm tours of successful operations. County agents provide annual updates using regional experts that provide the most current information on challenging issues. These meetings also provide a wonderful form of ex information exchange when growers and industry experts are all gathered in the same room. So contact your local county extension office to have your email address added to their database so that you'll be notified of available trainings in your region. A fourth tool available through the University of Florida are our research and education centers and on-farm trials. As I mentioned earlier, there are issues and challenges that sometimes arise without simple or economical solutions. This is an area where county agents work with state specialists to develop research trials at the experiment station or on-farm tests to evaluate multiple potential solutions. There are also on-farm tests that we do to compare crop, variety, crop varieties or pest control options to evaluate performance in a local environment. Another tool we utilize is digital media. Over the past 20 years, there's been a real shift in how information is provided. Like commercial industries, the Extension Service has also developed a digital platform to provide recommendations and information to farmers and ranchers 24 hours a day through websites, blogs, email newsletters, and through social media such as YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter accounts. Through these media, county agents can share information with growers faster than ever before. A sixth tool available through the University of Florida are pesticide safety trainings and certification testing. Although a number of products are offered over the counter for consumers, many of our pest management products that producers rely on 
have restrictions on who can apply them. Extension provides pesticide safety trainings to help pass the restricted use applicator license exams. There are also trainings required by the EPA for some products that we help applicators connect with. Through training attendance, applicators can earn their continuing education units, or CEUs, to help renew their license every four years. Without accruing these CEUs for renewal, they will be required to take the exams again in order to maintain their license. Both the training and exams are provided annually through county extension offices. Every county in Florida has county extension agents that serve their local citizens. Educational training, consultations, are all available to assist farmers and ranchers with science-based information to make informed decisions. Contact your local county extension office to find out what is available in your home county.